Good morning, guys. So, today is the 31st, actually, no, shit, it's the 1st of April, Wednesday. Um, you know, with all this COVID-19 coronavirus shit going around, it is still no excuse to let off your on your diet. You don't want to come out, because obviously a couple months of eating shit isn't going to do anything to you, but you don't want to come out, be low in motivation, and like have to clean up the mess, you know. So I'm on a cut at the moment, and I'm sticking to it. You know, like with this all this stuff going on, I can't go to my usual gym. Uh, I can't really get many groceries. But whatever, like despite that, diets on point. So today I'm going to show you guys what I think of Kodak pancakes bought from Costco. I don't know where else you can buy them, but I'm pretty sure. You know, wherever there's a Costco, you can get them. They're like, you know, the Costco essentials, kind of what they sell. And I'll show you how I make them, and they're amazing. This is the packaging. So, Kodak, Kodiak cakes. How you do them? Just with water, 14 grams. They give you a couple of options. You can track this all in My Fitness Pal, but when you track it, you should use the grams because I made the mistake of actually following the cups recommendation, which I'm not a fan of because I don't know why um, people in the US in general use cups, and that's a measurement for volume. You know, when you measure food, you can cram as much stuff into a cup as you can, but is that really going to be the same? You know, so I prefer to use weight. Got my trusty scale here. So 53 grams is one serving, which is half a cup. Um, I'm having two servings because I, you know, I'm a big boy. <laughs> um, so these are the options. Just with water, you get 14 grams of protein. With milk, 18 grams, and 21 grams with milk and egg. I'm gonna just be doing water today because I'm cutting. Don't have the calories, but I'll show you now. When it's made, water with these is just as good. Honestly, so good. All right, let's get let's get to it. syrup to cap it off.
that has got to be the easiest breakfast ever. Like, I don't normally have so much time in the morning, but since I've got nothing to do, I can't really go out, um, stay at home. So, this is it. Got a bit of time. Obviously, I can make my own pancakes with protein powder and all that. Like, that would be good as well. But today I'm doing a review of the Kodak, Kodiak pancakes. I don't know if I can call this one pancake. Where is it? Look at this little mini one. Mmm. <laughs> so, the texture is all up to you. So I like, I like a kind of thicker, fluffier, thicker consistency. So this is what it is. You have a look. Let's look. Mmm. So good. So good. Taste, because it's wholemeal and all that, I would say, and I didn't add milk or eggs, so I would say the taste would be, I would say the taste is probably a good 7 out of 10. Not bad. If you add milk and eggs, maybe 8 or 9. Um, obviously, it's nowhere near like real, real pancakes, but it's good enough. And it's got 14 grams of protein in. I did two servings there for 28 grams, if I do my maths correctly, which is, yeah. Um, so, yeah, highly recommend them. Kodak pancakes. Simple. And um, I had my coffee already, but normally I have this with my coffee, protein coffee, and that's a staple breakfast. Easy peasy. If you have a bit more time in the morning, why the hell not? If I don't have time, what I normally do is actually Greek yogurt mixed with protein, makes a kind of mousse. You know, simple, simple stuff, simple stuff. Um, making it simple, not spending too long in the kitchen. You know, that's how you hit your fitness goals, especially when you're cutting. Anything in life is no excuse to let your own body go to shit. So, there you go. If you liked the video, like, share and subscribe and I'll see you guys next time.